Hello everybody and welcome to the poor man's chemist. In this video we are going to be making molybdenum pentachloride um, because I did a poll asking you guys if you wanted to see exotic chlorides and a lot of you said yes so hey why not we'll keep going with this. Um, molybdenum pentachloride is very similar to niobium pentachloride they have this exact same molecular structure which would really i mean the more proper name would be dimolybdenum deca dimolybdenum decachloride got to drink less coffee before i start filming these things <laughs> And the same thing is true for niobium. It would be more appropriate to call it diniobium decachloride. So two of the chloride ligands are bridging ligands, which we haven't really talked about a lot on this channel, but they're actually pretty common things. Wikipedia has got an article about it that I'll link in the description if you're interested. But at any rate, we have our chlorine generator set up just like we did last time. Trichloroisocyanuric acid in the flask here. About, oh, I don't know, about, about 250 mils of 7 molar HCl. I just kind of eyeballed it. We have tap water going through our cold finger condenser. We got away with it before. Maybe we can get away with it again. And our drying tube with calcium chloride pellets in it coming down here to our little pellets of molybdenum which you can see there, and there's a picture on the screen showing you what they look like a lot closer up. The blue on them is um, molybdenum oxide. I'm not sure which particular one. I can't remember off the top of my head, but I'm sure that's on the screen now too. So I'm really hoping that that's not going to passivate the metal. I guess if it does, um, we can always try rinsing them with you know some hot nitric acid and see if we can remove the oxide coating uh i guess or maybe hcl maybe a non-oxidizing acid would be better anywho i don't know um atom mystery makes this sound like this reaction is going to be very easy I, maybe it will be i have not actually tried this yet so for all i know this is going to be very simple and i'm worried about nothing so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to get the gas generator started. We will get dry chlorine gas coming through here. Then I will um, use the burner just like I did last time to heat stuff up. And hopefully those little metal pellets will begin to glow with nice chlorine fire and it will make our product. I'm really hoping this goes as smoothly as the last one did. I guess we'll see. Anyway. I will come back when we have dry gas going through this fucker. Okay, everybody. We've got chlorine going through this thing. Believe me, I can fucking smell it. Holy shit. Our trusty redneck fume hood. Although this thing is old. Like, that little slow speed. That's actually high for this thing. I don't know. We're going to try it. We're going to see. At least till I get this fucker going. Oh, I hope this is just as easy to initiate as the other one was. I guess we're about to find out, huh? All right, let's give you guys a closer view here since now we know there's something to watch out for. There's our molybdenum. Very nice, very pretty. Okay. Here goes nothing. All right, there's our heat. Come on, you son of a bitch. Fucking light, you motherfucker. Okay, we've got fumage. Is this good? Yeah, maybe. Oh, shit. How much more heating does it need? I didn't heat it much last time. Oh, hello. All right. We've got vapor. We've got something. Something's starting to crystallize on this. But this is supposed to be dark. Oh, it's removing the oxide. Okay. Well, that's unfortunate. Well, fuck. off here for a second come on 
Come on, you son of a bitch. There we go. Is that focused? Are you focused, piece of shit? As I'm standing here risking, like, my life. Okay. How's that? Are we self-sustaining? Maybe? Possibly? Oh, oh. Oh, god damn. Okay, something's happening here. This is good. Oh, look, we got black shit. It's supposed to be black. Or really, really dark colored. Okay, I gotta step back. Holy god. Oh, yes, we getting black shit everywhere. But I don't see any chlorine fire. You guys see any fire? But we are getting black shit condensing out. We've got some kind of vapor. Well, the niobium. Oh, okay, okay. We've got dark vapor. This is good. It looks self-sustaining. Should I up the gas flow rate maybe a little bit? Okay, yeah, it's only condensing right up here at the top. So it's got to be generating heat. Okay, no, we've got our little vapor trail here. Can you guys see that? Focus piece of shit. Thank you. See? So I know we've got a good flow rate of gas because we're getting some decent exhaust. Okay. I turned the fan on low. But I don't see any more dark vapor. Do you guys see any? Hmm. Huh. Got a higher flow rate of gas now. Yeah, this needs to be heated continuously. So we need to adjust for this. Okay, all right. Um, okay, I know that I'm going to do. Oh, shit. I don't want that to suck the flame into the fan. That would be bad. Turn that up just a little bit. Oh dear. God in heaven. Ow! What the fuck? Okay. Oh, Jesus Christ! Fuck, fuck, fuck. <clears throat> Salvage it. Oh my god. Apparatus failure. Got a fucking cut on my hand. I don't even know how it got there. Okay. There we go. React, you fucker. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Burning your chlorinated hell. <laughs> okay, fan, you really kind of suck. And I really wish you wouldn't. Or rather, I wish you would more. There we go. Yes, thank you. Thank you, fan. Actually, do something, you fucking piece of shit. Piece of shit, camera. Piece of shit, fan. I'm surrounded by pieces of shit. Ooh. Okay. A lot more black shit. Black shit is good. It is so humid out here. 
I'm hoping that any molybdenum on pentachloride is just immediately breaking down and turning into um, hydrochloric acid and molybdic acid, which I think it is. I think that's what those white fumes are. Okay, looks like we need a little bit more heat. That's right. How about a little fire scarecrow? How you like that? Burn! Yes! <laughs> Whoa, wait. Why did I feel radiant heat for a second? That's not good. Okay, don't set the fan on fire. All right, this is completely unacceptable. Honestly. The things I do for my art. Ah, get away from the fucking apparatus. Okay. Well, we're getting a fair bit of it. Ooh, is it getting all crystally on us? Ooh, neato. How's our gas generator doing? Oh, shit. Don't do that one. That's not good. I'm trying to break something. Okay. Huh? Okay, we still got a reaction going here. I still see some dark fumes. At least I think I do. Well, maybe not. Oh, wow. Neato. Look at this shit. Uh, where'd it go? It is like crystallizing there. Okay, everybody. So, we had a minor problem with the gas generator, which I suspect allowed air to flow back in here and ruin some of this. Notice that bluish color down there? I'm thinking that might be the fucking oxide. Um, I've got it fixed, and it's running again. But, as you can see, we are getting bands of different colors here. I'm pretty sure there's black crystalline stuff here, which is nice and sparkly and crystalline at this point. It's quite visible. Um, that's our stuff. That's our molybdenum pentachloride. Now we've got a whole bunch of green shit up here. And I'm not sure if this is just a thicker layer of the product or what this is. Um... I didn't think this stuff was supposed to be green. I thought it was supposed to be like a dark violet color. I don't know. I mean, it's a very dark green, but like, look here. Like, look at this shit. I don't, I don't know if this is showing. Yeah, see that? That's a pretty vivid green. I don't know. I will have to look that up. But you, as you can see, down here, we've got nice, sparkly, crystalline molybdenum pentachloride. That is very pretty. That's what we still got chlorine going through here. Here is our solid at the end of it. It's nice and fucked up, covered with some kind of black crust. Not sure what that's all about. Man, I almost hate having to fucking take this thing apart because it is beautiful to look at. <laughs> oh my God, now it's like the green shit is starting to slowly turn into reddish shit. Is that good or bad? I wish I knew. I was not expecting this thing to be so many fucking colors or I would have done a little more reading beforehand. Still, that was a lot of fun. Well, I guess, um, let me shut down the gas generator here and, um, we'll take this puppy apart and look at it. I just need to call it something to close this little thing off here so it doesn't suck air back in. So, anyway, I will come back once it's cooled off and we're ready to take it apart and see what the hell we actually got. Okay, people. So, we have crystals of our product already starting to fall down into here. Let's see. Maybe if I come over from this other side here, you can see them a little better. 
Something is going wrong, I think. I think somehow, some way, air is starting to get into here and shit is starting to break down. Um, so since I'm in a hurry to try to salvage this, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna open this thing and I am going to pour it into dichloromethane here in which it's supposed to be soluble in organic solvents. And I know another source I found said chlorinated solvents. So I figure we'll give this a try. Oops, there goes nothing. All right, piece of shit, are you focused? Please tell me yes. Okay, we have our DCM here, here we go. Oh, well, shit, look at that, look at that sh Oh, yeah. Look at all the fucking product we got. Oh my God, that is awesome. Well, clearly this method works. We got a lot of it. Oh, come on, man. Let this shit dissolve in the dichlorophane. Okay, camera, will you stop doing that shit? I really fucking hate that. Okay, here we go. Ready? One, two, three, go. Well, something's happening. It's turning brown. Here's the solid being exposed to air. Oh, God damn, the smell. <coughs> Jesus. It's turning green. All right, so that's good. That tells us that green shit is probably a hydrolysis product. So that's probably what that green stuff is. Will you fucking focus for the love of God? Jesus, but fucking Christ. Okay. If we have niobium pentachloride in solution here, acetyl nitrile should reduce it to give us, I think, an orange compound. Survey says... Uh... Well, I hear the rattling of crystals. Um, interesting. What have you become? Okay, it's kind of the same color as molybdenum pentachloride gas was. Is this what it should look like dissolved in DCM? Or is this some kind of breakdown product? Well, it didn't react with acetyl nitrile. But that's supposed to reduce it to produce some kind of orange shit. Okay. Oh, well. Um, hold on. Let me show you something here real quick. Uh, crystalline. What it is. A little stack of... Oh, wait. What the fuck? How about that? Oh, it's the metal. That's what it is. But this stuff is not immediately breaking down. Look at that. It must be protected by a film of... The other shit. Okay, still, let's take a look at this shit. Okay, there's our pieces of metal. And they are more or less unchanged other than being a lot cleaner. Oh, Jesus. Oh, wow, look. Look at this shit. Now this shit is turning colors. Look, the brown is going away and it's getting replaced by green. Oh, shit. Okay, look at that. Huh. Well, that's pretty goddamn neat. What's green shit? I don't know. I'll put up a... Okay, so wait. I think this might have worked. Was that our niobium? Oh, I have no idea. I have no idea what just happened. Well, anyway. Let's, um, focus. Ah, that is a beautiful apple green. We still got crystalline solid here. Will you please focus on this? It's just kind of turning into goo. Okay. Well, we got some. This is turning all blue. Man, this is some ridiculously colorful shit. Turquoise, black sparkly crystals, green, brown, yellow. Fucking A. All right, um... Let's add water to this bitch and let's see what happens. Focus, piece of shit. I'm, I'm really starting to get annoyed with you and your camera brain damage here. It's getting fucking old. Okay, are we ready? Yes, maybe, kind of. Ooh. Okay. Is 
that's the sink, not this stuff. Well, it fumed, and we got goopy blue shit. What color is this? I can't fucking tell. Got over here. Well, this is just doing all kinds of stuff. These chlorides are kind of fun to play with. Well, let's dump out this shit. Uh, no idea. It's just like a really, really dark, almost kind of green color. Like a greenish brown. I have no idea what that is. Huh. I'm pretty sure the blue is oxide, though. That I feel pretty confident about. At least I, I think it is. I could be wrong there, too. All I know, it could be what the pentachloride looks like when it's been whacking off too much. Who the fuck knows? Neat. Well, that was fun and educational and messy. But still, that was pretty neat. Well, I'm going to wrap that up here because it's just kind of... Just like last time, I can make it. I don't really have a great way to keep it. Um, this time, however, it seems like this stuff is more sensitive. I think the niobium pentachloride was more stable than this stuff. Um, this stuff seemed like it was a bit more sensitive to moisture. Either that or the humidity is a lot higher, which it is ridiculously humid out here today. So, anyway... If you like that video, give it a thumbs up. And if you didn't, well, I don't know what it takes to please you. Subscribe, comment, share the video, please. It really does make a big difference when you share these videos. I'm not even kidding. It really does help. Um, donate a few bucks if you enjoy this kind of content and you like seeing videos coming out this frequently because the only way that can happen is with your support, y'all. And until the next one, you guys, I will see you later. That was fun.